Senpai.
Senpai, thank you. See you later, Senpai. Welcome back. Alright, let's go into the shopping district. That's a rather long social link event. Oops, went back home. What an idiot. And shopping district. Yet another night of fleshing out characters. For no reason other than entertainment. Oh no, I got this wrong. Oh, that's right. I know what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm not stupid. I'm supposed to be going to the hobby shop. Take another model scooter. Don't know why I was looking at the wrong day. Alright, let's go back home. Oh, no, 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 no. Again, I don't know what I'm doing. I keep thinking that I want to make a new model scooter, but that's not it. I just wanted to pick one up. And we'll kill the evening by talking with Chie. Hello. Ah uh, yes, Naoto also has a scooter. I hope that kind of went without saying given that uh, when I listed all the scooter people and the trip to the spring that I only excluded Kanji and Teddy. But Naoto also has a scooter. Speaking of Naoto, let's uh, start working on this fortune social link. Hello. Yes.
Yes. I'll see you again. Welcome back. Well, it appeared that uh, Naoto and I have a case on our hands. See, this is why it's one of my favorite social links. It actually has a very interesting conflict. Let's head to the north side. See, tonight... Our evening will be going to Kanji, one of our social links that's actually still active. Senpai! Yeah! Well... have this, senpai. Night. Good morning. Yo! It's quite all right. Hey! 
Excuse me. Good day. So every girl in the game has, or rather, every girl on the team has their own little morning umbrella scene. I may have said that before, and that was Naotos. So you have that option of uh, pairing her off with either yourself, Yosuke, or Kanji. I've never seen what happens if you pick Yosuke, but I've definitely seen the Kanji one. And I thought I'd insert myself in there just for uh, for fun. And I feel like that's kind of what what you know, people would want to see, and especially because that was the proposal that hadn't been made yet. Hello. Senpai. I'll see you again. Welcome back. I don't have time for love affairs. Now, To, you should see my social links. Yeah, give me all that money I didn't need. All right, Nanako, what do you have for me? Oh yeah, I got the bead ring. Love me the bead ring. Let's make lunch for tomorrow.
Hey. Damn, that's good. How do I know whether or not these lunches will be someone's favorite or not? Extensive testing. You don't want to know how many times I had to reload games trying to figure out how much someone likes a certain meal. All right, let's spend another afternoon with Nauta. We're really making progress here. Hello. Yes. That isn't it.
I'll see you again. This is gonna be a tough case. I mean, catch the Phantom Thief. I've been trying to do that for two years. Every time I get close to catching the Phantom Thief, it gets delayed. That's why we're here. That's why we're doing this. That's the whole purpose of the hype train. Let's go to the north side and kill the night with Chie. Me to you. Good night. Yo. On top of planning it, Kashiwagi's gonna be in it? So that's why she agreed to plan this event. a lot of signups here. I'm surprised so many people took an interest. Whoa, Risei Kujikawa? Seriously? Oh man, trust a celebrity to kill the fun of it all. I bet she'll draw a huge crowd. Wow, Yukiko-san's finally entering. If this was any other year, she'd win for sure. Now she's up against Rosette. It's gonna be a culture festival to remember. Huh? Rosette's entering? She's gonna take part in something like this? Maybe I better think more seriously about saving a seat. Look, Chie's entering too. She's actually pretty close to my type. Actually, I hear she has a lot of secret admirers. Naoto's that boyish, girlish, whatever, right? You know, she's, uh, pretty cute. <laughs> Dude. You sound like a pervo when you laugh like that. But to be honest, I think she's cute too. <laughs> Yo, are you free for lunch? I don't know why, but Chie asked us to come to the roof. She looked pretty serious. I wonder if something's happened. Oh, and Kanji's coming too.
isn't me? Why do you automatically blame me? I mean, if you don't want to do it, you just say no, right? Like it was just a joke. We wouldn't be so pissed if we could do that! With Kashiwagi planning this year's event, even those who got entered by other people can't back out! Seriously? Must have been something in the fine print I overlooked. So it was you! Oh, crap! Hey, do you want us to take part in the beauty pageant? Well, yeah. I mean, you guys know how popular Yukiko is here. And on top of that, we have an idol and a detective prince. What's the point of having a beauty pageant if all these incredible heroines aren't going to take part? So where do I fit in? Oh. Well, excuse me for not fitting in! Hey, you want them to be in it too, don't you, Kanji? Huh? I ain't interested in that stuff. Naoto-kun, Kanji-kun says that he really wants you to be in it. What? I, I didn't say nothing. What about you? You want them to be in it, right? onto the bandwagon with Yosuke, aren't you? So long as there are people looking forward to seeing me, I might as well put on a show for them. Of course, there's no need to involve my agency in this. That's right! That's the way to go! Teddy's looking forward to it, too. Actually, I think he was more excited than anyone. It was him who was pushing me to sign you all up. <gasps> so Ted's behind this, too! We're in an awkward position. If we can't refuse, I suppose there's no sense in arguing the point. But it seems ill-fitting for someone like me to get up on stage. I wonder if there's any way I could take it up with the school authorities. Uh, I don't think it's a problem at all. I, I mean, just do it, you know? Seriously. Dude, looks like your blood's boiling even more than usual. Silly Kanji, just tell her you want to see her on the stage. So, is it a deal? The four of us will be in the beauty pageant? What are you saying? Um, I beg you, please be in it. If you do, my, uh, doubts will finally be cleared. Come on, make me a man! Doubts? What are you talking about? Look, just... Just do it, damn it! I mean, you're an ace detective, aren't you? What does that have to do with a beauty pageant? <laughs> We're back! I'm so tired! Where'd you guys go? Over to Jeunesse. We had to go get some paint and cloth. Oh, for the decorations. Thank you. Did you have them write you an invoice? Yeah, I think they understood what it was for, so they wrote it without us having to ask. There's some things I want to go over about the day of the event. Is this about the group date cafe? Yes, since Yosuke's leading the executive committee. Wait, what? It was your proposal, right? Are you serious? Well, all you have to do is the reception. After people sign in, have a few guys and girls sit facing each other at a table, conduct a short session first where they ask each other questions. After about half an hour of that, it'll be confession time. Get them to select the number of the person they like. If the other person accepts, that makes them a couple. Hey, Yosuke, you listening? <sighs> yeah, I hear you. <laughs> Stop it. Hey, if we roll up this bit of cloth, won't it kind of be like a ball? Yeah, okay, I'll be the catcher. Why the catcher? Hey, Yosuke, want to be the batter? <sighs> uh, I don't give a damn anymore. I'm in. Watch me slam that ball right back into your face. Hey, 
You guys better get serious about this. You're back. Oh my, what a disaster the Culture Festival is turning out to be. But at least it's actually going to happen, unlike a certain game. Alright, let's take the bus, actually. I'm going to go to the hospital, work the janitor job. Hey, it's Yosuke. We're expecting great things from you. <laughs> They're doing the cross-dressing pageant again this year? Man, they never learn, do they? Ooh, some people have signed up already. <laughs> Man, what idiots would want to be in this thing? Let's see, Yosuke Hanamura... Me?! Wait, and Kanji Tatsumi? You're on here, too! Wow, there's a lot of contestants. Didn't we only get, like, two people last year? I heard this year, even if someone else signs you up, you can't back out. Well, that's not cool. Hey, but what if they did sign themselves up? Ew, what a disturbing thought! Seriously, that's really wrong! Someone else signs you up? It's them! They must have done this! good explanation for this for what for what my ass for signing us all up in the cross-dressing pageant it was you wasn't it oh that thing Risei chan started saying let's all have fun with this so I didn't really have a choice and Kashiwagi seems happy too now that there's more people involved in it you little this is cross-dressing! Cross-dressing! Well, you're the one who started it! It's because of you that we can't back out of the beauty pageant, so it serves you right! That's beside the point. Don't worry. We'll make you absolutely enchanting, okay? That's not what's important here. It's about a man's pride, damn it! Whoa, are you serious? Yeah, yeah, this has nothing to do with pride or any of that. You know already, right? Once someone signs you up, you can't back out. If you got a problem with that, go talk to Ms. Kashiwagi. <laughs> There's no way she's gonna listen. What? Why are you giving up? I ain't doing this, period. Kanji-kun, are you still okay as far as the mandatory attendance policy? I don't think it would be wise to disappoint a teacher too much. You are a scary gal. You know that, senpai? 
Just leave it to us to dress you guys up. Risa Chan's with us too. There's no way you won't turn out pretty. Yeah. You're positive we'll be pretty? I guarantee it. Hey, why are you suddenly fine with this? Well, if we gotta do this, might as well go all the way with it. There's nothing manly about being a woman. I seriously refuse. Kashiwagi's sure gonna get angry if you don't show up. Maybe you and Kanji-kun can be classmates next year. Why is this happening? We all end up in the same boat without our consent. What kind of joke is this? Uh, the exact same joke you pulled on us? If we gotta do this, might as well go all the way with it. <laughs> oh, welcome home, big bro. Like I said, disaster. many people passing by here in the first place. I think we need some shills to drum up interest. Shills? Uh, who? Who else is here besides us? Isn't that kind of sad? Do we have a choice? We need customers to get the ball rolling. If there aren't many people passing by, we have to get the attention of the ones who are by any means necessary. But there's only five of us here. Yo, how's it going? I came to check up on you... guys. Perfect timing! But now we've got four guys and two girls. Eh, you guys are cross-dressing tomorrow anyways. Why don't you can sit on the girls' side? What? I'm not gonna... Oh, you're volunteering? You never run out of surprises, man. Well, let's get started. Uh, uh you guys can start now. Uh, will someone please start? <sighs> Man, he's really getting into this. Uh, actually, what the hell is this? A mock group date? Um, should I lead off? I guess I'd like a cute girl. <laughs> well, for me, um, I guess a girl that's kind and sort of fragile, you know? Someone I'd want to protect. Um, uh, man, this is, uh, um, yeah. Uh, hey, your turn, Kanji. Uh, well, I, I guess someone who's kind of mysterious. And, uh, looks strong, but it's actually kind of... Yeah, I really wonder who you're talking about. Uh, oh, okay, uh, out of the three of us here, who would you date? Hey, I object to this line of questioning. 
Oh, don't worry. All right, let's start with you, Chiesan. Huh? Wait, um... <laughs> uh, well... I don't think that's why she's looking over. Uh, me? Uh, who would I choose to date? Well, th that's private. Isn't it? Okay, your turn. Who would you want to date? Okay, we get it. You're good at role-playing. Now quit it. You're creeping me out. There are many forms of love. Didn't you tell me something like that? No, not at all. Well, I admit I'm pretty dependable and decent looking, right? Date Cafe is officially a failure. Welcome back. Oh my god, that last one always gets me. I love Margaret so much. I'll touch for your heart, but see my truth. 